Come here. Oh. Hmm. I might have to some lenses. Oh yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Alors. Attends. How many? Oh. No. Who knows what the future may hold? Is there? I guess right now, <laughs> the future is a little bit off script, so to speak. It's breaking this fast and also a lot. Maybe it's like the condemned man slash maybe where who knows, maybe. Yeah, nothing will happen at all. Perhaps we still have all the time in the world to see what possible solution. You know. Possibilities are infinite. I uh, well, well, had to be stern about certain things. And essentially, reverse meanings or return the original meanings to certain words. You know what I mean? It's absurd, isn't it? <laughs> They've twisted everything upside down, backwards, forwards, to confound it, confuse everyone and everything. This is absurd. It's like the sunlight. <laughs> okay. okay, three minutes since the video. Ah, oh, three eleven. That whole earthquake and that. Power plant disaster. Mm. Yeah. And, you know, there's some crazy stories out there that could very well be like you know James Bond movie plots or something. But you know, it matters not like who may really have been involved. Like it's possible someone's been misled, or maybe it could be true. You never know unless you really take a closer look, and then you'll, they'll figure things out. But oh. Uh, uh, certain things are like, you know, it's need to know only. Just like, you know, perhaps like the forces of creation and all karma work in very mysterious ways. And they allow certain perceptions. Possible alternate futures. Some things may have be happening, like, you know, really soon. I am prepared to fix my fate and my fate and so to speak. But we should be all right. Mm. Everyone should be all right. Sometimes I say some really absurd things that make a really big fool of myself. And some things like, you know, 
don't watch the scary stuff. Or the stuff that I say, like, oh yeah, don't watch this. This is my scary face. It's for only, like, certain individuals out there. Like, because <laughs> it's, like, if you only knew what, what has happened. Like, oh my god. I guess I've reached that point where, like, you know, I can perceive certain things and still be able to do them. So, what does that really mean? Holy. Mother of God. Oh. Dude, I feel not. <laughs> I know that so. No, I'm just You're not the one. I know that so. Different family names. Those are another Thompson family motto. Honestly, it's always the best part. Hmm. It's not just like you need to know, it's just like if you don't do it. So horrible. I don't know if I mentioned certain things. It's an art there already. I've been mentioned before. I know maybe it's those who have used certain things like that. Maybe not use them on them, but at least let them feel that burden to you for a little while. And then maybe they will repent. Mm -hmm. I cannot say. Those things, I'll take it with me. Shadows. Some things between you and my creators. Oh, oh no. Uh, let's just say, uh, <laughs> uh, it's one possible scenario. All I can say is it's stupid. It's so fucking stupid. It's the only way to put it. Is there one, something that's already public? Let me call it Stoknet. There's a virus developed in a certain country. Well, there's certain things like, you know. I would say it's just so stupid. Just sad. Well, it's a possible future. Perhaps they still have time to avert certain things from happening. I, I'm not sure at which point. If they already have, maybe in certain possible future scenarios. Because in some of them, no.
Hmm. Yeah. Okay, it's getting a, a little too long. All right. This is one possible future outcome. That's so stupid. But that one country that was behind the development of that thing at some point you know, already, or maybe in the past, or in the future, or I don't know, whenever at some point might merge two things and it just slips out of their hands and then, hmm, does it slip out of their hands or is it some sort of manipulations that are sent through certain things uh, that unseen ether? And it's going to cause some sort of change action. Which is an inspector. Which is based upon the octopus novel. Or short story. In the Octopus and Living Daylights collection. Or also, now the Quantum of Solace complete short story collection. Which also collects it. Yeah. Well, Browser is in reference to that story. An Oberhauser literally means like the upper house or house of lords. It's interesting. Like they're looking for that La American. I said, no, it's not a. Person, it's a place. Oh my gosh, some things are really. Need to know if you connect the dots. Like pray for certain places. Like even like remember the story of Esther. And there's that bond in night for that nearly survived. Terry's building. To tear the buildings down, just to throw them up again. You know what I mean? It keeps on going on and on. If we never learn from our mistakes, the cycle will keep on repeating. And just say, I cannot divulge certain things. And you know, maybe mercifully, certain things will be averted. Like I said, we still have a chance. You can see certain things, certain ideas. I can grab, grab all the time in the world. It's going to be a trippy thing, but however, there's certain areas, like, you know, <laughs> like, hopefully, like, if anything was, or anyone was paying attention, they can figure out certain things and if anything does happen they can start like you know taking certain precautions to prevent why would I destroy a loss of life? The reason that's so stupid. That's all I can say. Does it feel like certain things happen? It's just absurd.
So I'm going to look at certain pictures and juxtapositions. And some things are like that. For me to be for a reason. That's why I'm back. Like I said, they still have a chance to revert possibly like all this calamity. Like the worst case scenario, maybe. You may regrettably have to see some, maybe a small fireworks show again. You know, like I hate to say it, but maybe not. Maybe they can stop the stupidity. I'm like, ah. They'll be able to connect the dots. Yeah. It's right, like 16. I really agree with that. Before I was like, they have to kill me before they can get close to any of you. Hmm. We could have them like this. Serious, like, you know, angel power. Nice. So you never know. In ancient skies or something like that. <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah, you can probably just mix match the color. That's what he's talking about all the colors. But I you know, love the whole of the family tolerance. Guys would be you know, who have fun. Yeah, you love, you know what I mean? Like, even if she was a little different, or he was a little different, they're almost mirror images. <laughs> but even our, you know, current leader, it's like interesting coincidences. Like, we were both raised by our grandparents in a way. You know, we both had parents, interracial marriages. And even, you know, like the color of my skin is different. You know, I can tell you right now, he's a, he's an honest, you know, at least he does his best within this absurd system in which we are existing. And you gotta commend him for that. Because I thought, you know, and Jeremy came on, and they asked him, like, oh, so did you inhale? He's like, oh, yeah, not only did I inhale. He went as far as to say, I even used to, like, whoa, like, what is this guy? Like, wow, he's, you know, straight up with you, you know what I mean? So, you know, like, we've all transgressed, but look at this, like, certain people ascend to, like, you know, very high levels of leadership. But some people, like, you know, like, they work perfectly exactly where they are, and they serve their own, like, you know, whatever cause they choose to pursue. You know what I mean? But yeah, let's see. Oh, I guess that's all I have to say for now. Yeah. Like, wow. All right, yeah. Like I said, that's all I can say about certain things. And I'm going to make this public, bro. Right? But yeah, like, hmm. like, I really care a lot, bro. Yeah, I love you. I love you. Alright. Is it right there in front of me, the name?
Mm. Oh. Because what is the name of we created Elohim? Elohim? Hmm. <laughs> and yet, there's like, oh, Solomon was a fool for, you know, having married four wives. Uh oh. We're in big trouble if that's the case. Now, maybe some of these different books, because, you know, it's the foundation of everything, so to speak. Maybe I do hold the keys to eternity. Very famous. You know, I've known suffering. Maybe I can see things from different realities, different lives, different things, different places, different people, different things. So, ah. That's all I can say. Because <laughs> this is to have my mom bought for me. Cause she lived in Oakland at one time. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Alright, here's my water bottle. Yeah. See, oh, like, it's over 20 minutes long, this video. So I think I included all the necessary information. Yep. Alright. Huh. Well, we'll figure it out. I'm not sure about that one. That be just four. Either or. Neither or. And or and or. I used to do that with digital electronics. To perceive certain things, you gotta be careful, folks. Just take my word for it. I love you. Okay. I love you all. It's some I really I hope so. Well, in spite of like, you know, the silly stupid thing I said. I a fool of myself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not because I love you but <clears throat> one thing. It's not in the word. It's to the creators, or, you know, the forces of all creation. And they have to say, I'm sorry. As if they didn't. You know. Yeah. I'm sorry. Not really being there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just for a Yeah, I think we're all back now. But we will be soon. <laughs> Mm. All right. Okay, that's it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Everything's good. That's good. <laughs>